this is Burton Bradstock in Dorset and we've come with the masses to look for some pleasure. Oh, these waves certainly give pleasure. Look at the height of them and the foam and the noise and the power and the possibility of rushing in and not getting your feet wet. But this dog doesn't seem interested whatsoever. He's more interested in digging something up and now he wants to get away. He's just fed up with those waves but the fascination is so intense. But now the dog has some slight interest. The girl's had enough of it. She's going back to the hut. We're going back to find her mummy. And people there sheltering from the wind, reading books, reading their Kindle players or their phones. Other people it's like a French film where they've fallen out. Oh, and now they've made up that the child has fallen out and she's running away. And now the child's coming back. It's all going to be a happy family. What's happening here? Ah, nearly got feet wet. Little girl come back. Little girl in red coat. Is it the same one or a different one? Dog's still eager to get away. Here we have complete chaos. How are we going to get pleasure from this day? How on earth? Look, such a diverse crowd. Are they related or are they not? Is she sending a text message? Is he looking at something on the ground? What's happening here? Yoo-hoo! Hello! Oh, he's found something. And she's still on the text message. Now, what's in that blue bag? I've got lots of pictures of this man with the blue bag. We'll never know. Oh, we flew away again now. We're on our way home. Looking at St. Catherine's Chapel again. Seeing the Jezel Beach in the background. And the surf round in the loop going round. And more people looking for pleasure. Oh, and there's my good wife, Helen. And, oh, there it is, Burton Bradstock. Just saying goodbye again. Goodbye, Burton Bradstock. Hello, John. You're hiding the number plate of the car there, aren't you? Well done. You've had the almost imponderable joy of watching the John Simpson channel, which means you are a really good person.